Hello, welcome back to Emir. It's time we go on a bit of an expedition. We have, we actually did get a new uh, tech in here, the crafting skins of vegetables, which gives us weaving. I've got my two artisans working on that. So that'll be done in like 12 hours. The other ones uh, haven't come in yet. They're still working on them. I um, I really need the knowing the plans, I think. The um, doctoring, which is only 39%, that's kind of terrible. Doctoring is, is kind of an issue. Can I put this more of you on this right now? I don't really want to because we can't really support the food. It didn't change that didn't change that any. So I'm gonna leave it uh no no just cancel that. Just I mean, just leave the ten on there, I guess. Um that didn't change my success rate any by doing that. It just cost me some more food. Well, anyway, um we um we still think some growth issues in, in town and it probably has to do a little bit to do with, with our uh, we're supporting too many troops. We have more troops supporting than we can support. Um we have a lot of available jobs here. We are going to go and, well, there's more than that now. It was like 20-something, but we just put a bunch into researching again. Uh, we're going to go and see if we can do some exploring. Uh, see about these mountains over here. Um, I noticed the barbarians are gone. The ones that attacked me before, they're all gone. I don't know what happened. Maybe somebody came in here and, uh, and cleaned them up for me. Anyway, let's go walk. Let's move over here and do a bit of exploring. We're gonna, we, we saw this mountain before. Has We know that it has, there's apparently llamas everywhere. Um... It has copper. Let's see the other mountains while we're at it. I'm going to go ahead and move into this one. I'm kind of hoping we can find a, a batch of porcos also that we can bring back to our town because we could really use some more people. Uh, we're kind of desperate for more people, actually. It may not be the best idea to go around and, and build a new place right now, but I got the urge, the itch, to uh, to grow. So we're going to go and do that. And that way, also, uh, this is the way we solve the problem of rebellion. Because if one town rebels, then we'll have another town. And that's my secret. It's probably a bad secret, but but uh, that's what we have so far. And I'm also eager to build in a mountainous area. That seems exciting. So we'll see what we have in all these. So it's going to be a, a day of exploration. Oh, this has got like a peak to it. A day of exploration today. Uh, I'm really looking forward to having... We need copper, obviously. Um, coal's not that big a deal. We have plenty of wood. Um, if we could get some place that has additional food source, which be, is, is okay, but we have a ton of food being in the tropics, so it's not really that big of an issue. Uh, but mostly we're just looking for copper. And tin would be great. Um, and we don't really need iron at the moment, so I'm not really concerned about that. So really just copper is all we're looking for. But if we could find a place that has copper and something else, that would be ideal. What's this white stuff? Gravelly ground. All right. There is nothing here. This is a terrible place other than fish and llamas. So let's look over here. This one is is uh, landlocked and right next to old Megarian over here. But, you know what, Megarian, maybe we could be friends and, and you not mind me building right next to you. It's a little ways away from my home. The The issue with building this extra town is going to be uh, my administration. Uh, or my state power. It's going it's to take a hit by doing this. But, but we're hoping the, the, the goods outweigh the bads by doing this. Well, there's some clay. We have clay. There is some iron. What else do you have? Tell me, if you have copper... I'm settling here. Got some some not fertile places over this way. Why is the tropics so well? This is a mountainous tropic. That's why the fertility is terrible. This is a really uh, not fertile. Oh, and there's there's copper. Wait a minute. You have copper, iron, and clay. I think I'm sold. Um, there's a little bit of fertility, but this is gonna be a a rough place to grow at. Um. It's all like one fertility, so it's gonna be it's gonna be rough. Um, but I can't pass that up. That's that's really good. That's what we need. We can build our little town up here on this on this peak here. I think we'd be set. Let me go look at that other that one other place. If we can find one that's just like that, just not neighboring uh, him, then that would be even better. So let's do one more look and see what we can find. Now again, we can't mine this iron yet or the stone. Um, not stone. We can't mine stone. We can't mine the copper yet. But we just want to go ahead and claim our land because if we don't have any sort of copper late in the game, we're going to have to end up going to the trade market, and that's going to be a problem. Plus, having that will mean we can go to the trade market and make some cash. Probably with the iron. By the time we get to trade, iron's going to be the thing. Uh, well, there's some iron over there. Do you have copper? If you do, and and this has has more decent ground... You have clay. Come on, copper. Come on, copper. 
I like this place better if it has copper, which I don't see it. Oh, oh, there it is. Oh, okay. Uh, it has copper deposits. We want the copper. We're going to build here. This is it. This is our new home. There is no water, but that's fine. We can build up on this little step here. Uh, perfect. We're building here. Okay, so let's go settle over there and uh, create a town. I've got, we're already stocked up here. We, we already have all of our, our supplies and everything, so we're good to go. We're going to walk over here. Hopefully not everyone dies, um, and we can start planting some beans, I guess. There's some barbarians hanging out over here. Hey, guys. Hello, friends. Hello. Um, now let's settle. We're going to send everyone in. Uh, there's no piglets in the formation, but all the, all the, what's it called? Squeaky Grunch? No. How about... Not Magaria, we already have one of those. Um, how about... We'll make, we'll make it our own name. This is going to be called Mount... Um, oh, Tinti. We're pray, we're, this is the name of our of our gods, our pig gods. Mount Tinti. yes. Okay, don't fail me, Mount Tinti. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and let these guys... Uh, well, you know what? I'm going to leave them. We're going to do some exploring with these guys. We're, let's do some exploring. We don't have a lot of movement left, but we can go, you know, check a few things out. Maybe we can find some some folks out running around in the wilderness. Um, let me go here to the mount and get set up. So we need to get some gathering camps immediately set up so we can get our food run, running in here. We do have a bit of food, right? Do we have all our supplies here? Yeah. Okay. So uh, everyone's building their shacks up on top of the mountain. They just throw their, their tools on the ground, you slobs. All right. Um, I want to go ahead and get gathering camps and things working. We're going to go ahead and do those, I guess, over here. Oh, yes. Um, right over this way. We're going to set up a gathering camp first, which we'll just set up here on the edge. He can just overlook his fields. Uh, what, what a day. Um, I think I have enough camps for... I have enough for beans. Uh, I need to tell them to stop eating these. Don't eat the beans. Don't eat the rice. You can eat a little bit of it. And don't eat the corn until we get more of it. Okay. Um, okay, so we can get three fields here. I'm going to go ahead and get it set up for three. I have plenty of hammers, so we'll set one there. We'll set one over, I don't know, over there. And we'll stick one over this way. Um, right over here. We can't really have giant fields yet. We're not really that trained. But that'll be our three fields. That's good. That's all. This is all level two fertility, which is not the greatest. But it's something. Uh, we desperately need to get a well set up here. Which, which I can do. Um, here. We're gonna put that one... I can't put it there. No. Um, it doesn't really matter where it goes, I guess. We just want something with water. Groundwater, right? 1175, 1185. That's actually really good. So we'll just stash it right there. Sure. Next to the fancy plant. Um, I'm gonna put in... a couple of these. Stash one over here by the farms. It just seems... Just, it just makes sense. Are you fertile? 8.5, 9.2... 12. I'm assuming that has something to do with it. So there, there's a well there. Okay, so that should be enough water for us. Is that water up here? No, that's just, that's uh, clay. Um, we need to get a... There's nothing to hunt here, right? No, the llamas that are here aren't technically huntable llamas. They're just, they're just here to look at us. We didn't bring any javelins anyway. Um, woodcutter... I, I, Mm, let's see. I'm going to just do this. This is nine pigs. How many pigs do we have living here right now? We have ten. So ten pigs can work. So we can get one extra guy who I guess could do... Yes. Okay. Okay. Well, there we go. So he'll work the well. Okay. So once these are done, which only takes a couple minutes, one minute to be exact, we will start throwing our hoes out there and get them made. We only brought... We brought 18 hoes. Good. So we get plenty to get... Some fields started up, and then uh, we'll be set. Somebody ate a bean. Somebody ate a piece of corn as well. You stop that, you fatties. Uh, we're going to set up all of our stockpiles up over this way, um, like uh, this. I'll put in a granary. We'll stash a couple of these on the side, which requires someone to work them, so we won't really use those just yet, but we'll get them eventually. And then lots of lots of ground storage. Lots and lots. Get to farming. We're going to go and put in some beans over here. We're going to go with the, with the groundwater of, or the fertility of two is what we want. We're throw as many beans as we possibly can. We want the two, not the 1.9. Whoops. Okay, so there's eight of them. That's decent. Um, we're going to come over this way. I don't have a whole lot of hoes. I want you to make me some corn. 
Okay, so I got four hoes left. We will do four of the rice. Which I have a ton of rice being grown at the other place. So there's the four of that. So it's not going to bring a ton in, but it's going to bring it. Should be enough to keep us afloat. Battle needs will be met here momentarily. Um, water and food. It'll, it'll, when, it, when the tick hits, it'll be good. Where's my well? It's not being built yet. We got uh, an hour for a well? Oh, man. I didn't know well took that long to build. Okay, well, everybody drink your spit for about an hour, and then we'll be good. Okay, so there's there's a start. Um, we got four corn. Yeah, we got 17 rice. I'm going to let you guys eat a little bit of rice while you're here so you don't die off, you know, immediately. So you can have some rice. That will settle that food need, which should pop in here in a minute. And they'll have a little bit of food. And then we should be gaining food in a moment. And then in an hour, we'll have well water. And then we'll be set up. Nobody will die. Well, maybe a few. But, you know, greater good and all that in 52 minutes. Okay, so let's go back out to our uh, our explorers, our brave explorers, and see how they're doing around this way. We'll have to make sure we get some administration set up here before too long. And I don't know if it's ideal to, to connect this. I don't really know. We have a decent amount of administration over here, so we, we could build, you know, a spot there and a spot there. Let me go ahead and do it. This claim, this is only two to claim that one, and we can claim another one. Four, six, and that's fine. At least we're all connected here, so that's that seems like something good. Um, I don't want to go on any sort of murderous rampage here. Let's just go explore some things. We only have 16, so we can't do a lot. What's that going to take to go there? Oh, a lot. Only four to go there, so let's go explore the easy countryside before we go through the giant mountains. We're going to go out here. We're going to get lost, and we don't have anyone that can carry stuff. So if we find something good, we're going to be in trouble. What we could do is have them just kill... I, I think this is a better idea. You can't make it there, though. You're short one. I should let them go back and kill the llamas. Hang on a minute. What are you? Your llamas? Let's go kill some llamas. Come on over here and and hunt these llamas. Nope. You can't hunt the llamas, but you can you can go over there and in time hunt some llamas. We'll carry the llamas back to Mount Ontinti so they can have a little bit of meat, so they'll be a little bit happier. They can like lick you know, drink the juices of the of the meat there and then they'll be good. Which I guess I can do that even though I didn't look like I had enough. But whatever. Okay, so there's our battle going on right now. So we'll let things play out here. We'll get some wells set up, and I think we'll be in in good shape. We uh, we don't have any new new um, diplomacy things going on. Quite a bit of time has passed. I'll I'll catch you up with what all has happened here. But uh, we this is a very good thing that we have the the constant naggings of the sow and some grumpy uh, villager has gone out into the woods and discovered twenty meat and fifteen leather, which is excellent for us because I'm going to show what's going on here. Um, I, I did a recording a little while ago, but. Something screwed up about it, so it didn't work, but let me catch you up about what all has happened here. Mostly what's happened is we've met several of our neighbors. For instance, we have uh, Death of Blaze over here to our east. We also have, uh, where is he? Um, somewhere, uh, Drake Hawkins is somewhere somewhere around here. He is, um, if you don't know Drake Hawkins, he, he, record, he streams this, I think, every Saturday he streams. Uh, anyways, he gave us all kinds of good stuff. Um, where is he? Uh, ideas. He gave us a whole bunch of ideas from Drake Hawkins, Drake Hawkins, Drake Hawkins. He gave us things like leadership, which we're working on. He gave us animal capture, which we have learned already, um, which allows us to grab the, like the llamas and bring them back and put them into pens. He also taught us, has given us archery. We haven't learned that one just yet. Uh, Rob Porkyface has given us metallurgy. Thanks, Rob Porkyface. Um, that's all that we've got from him. So we've, we've been moving along pretty well. We've got some text coming in. Well, I say pretty well. We've been moving along kind of terribly, actually. And the problem is um, pigs keep dying. Our growth rate is terrible. And I don't entirely know why. I think I'll, I think what it has, the problem is sickness. We're in the jungle, right? Or we're in the uh, tropics. And I, I think maybe that seems like that's a really high number. Um, we have food. And I keep bringing food back to these places. You can see I got 31 meat here. I went, I've been on a bit of a hunting spree, grabbing meat, carrying it back. We do have llamas here as well, uh, trying to get this place to th to survive. Uh, same thing here with Ruthenia here, who at one point had like 350 pigs. We're down to 149. That's actually better than what we had. But we have 50 available jobs at this place. 
Growth is finally looking good, though. I, I brought some meat back. We have 96% of our vital needs met. Still, sickness isn't a problem. And we have two food access things happening here. So we're slowly getting things moved around here. Um, I think maybe what I need to do is do a bit of exploring. And uh, I went and killed some more llamas here. We gotta wait till we get to 50 till we can uh, leave this space. We got 18 more meat we're gonna bring back home with us. We may actually bring it over here, actually, instead. Uh, we'll probably, we'll probably bring it home. Um, I also need to get some, some hose brought over here. We're gonna grab it here, come down here, grab some hose, and then run back. I can't go here right now because we have to have 50 to leave to unencamp. Um, also, whoever this is, Chieftain of... Uh, Chieftain of Hope has brought 10 piglets in here for some reason. I don't know why there's 10 piglets sitting in my kingdom. I don't know if we know who that is, but there's piglets hanging around. Uh, let's take a look at the towns and see how things are looking here. We'll go to Mount Untinti first. So we've got, uh, we have a couple houses that have been made. I'm trying to get that made a little faster. Uh, we have our pasture. Our pen is down here. Notice llamas are in the pen. Excellent. We can start getting a butcher going and get that taken care of. We do have, uh, what, three hoes, so let's use those. Um, severe, again, severe lack of, of pigs around here. Which one are you doing? You're doing the rice. Only you're bringing me in 0.2, which is terrible. What are you bringing me in? You're bringing in 0.4 beans, uh, but you're at 100%, so I'm not going to worry about you. And then how about you over here? 93%, you are bringing me in corn. So I will plant some corn. I will plant uh, all the corn that we can. I can do one more. Are you good? You're at 100% now, so I'm going to put a second one in here. Can I hire one? I don't know who I'm going to take them from. I'm going to hire another one in here and get one more corn spot set in here. Like that. So hopefully we get some more corn flowing in here that will help us keep us a bit alive around here. Um, I mean, water's fine. All that stuff's sort of fine. We can, we can get a butcher eventually and start cutting that meat up um, once I get a leather as well. Um, I think it's what I need for that. Right, yeah, one leather. Which I use to make a house. I wonder if I should just bulldoze a house. Get that leather. I think I, I think I will. Do you require leather? I'm going to bulldoze the fancy house. Sorry, sorry guys. I apologize. But your house is going away. I want your leather just real quick so I can get a butcher going and then we can start repeating that process. I think that will um, keep us looking all right here. Um, conflict loyalty is all really good. Everyone seems to be hap reasonably happy. They just are not growing because of sickness and things. And we can... Um, what else, what's, what all is new here? We got uh, tanneries we can do. Butcher's new. Uh, paddock is, is here. I think granary might be new as well. Um, we've all unlocked. We have the... the um, forums, of course, for uh, for culture, and we have Elders Council, which we have one of those in our capital, to help with uh, with some of the crime problems. So, um, keeping livestock is complete, which, that's what this one is, right? So, we've got that one taken care of. We had, a uh, we hunted two llamas, and we killed them, we took their meat, that's the camp that's sitting out, um, a little ways out, I mean, whoops, there we go. Um, as far as tech, I'm uh, I've got it set on everything I want to do. We could, I'm not I'm gonna I really want knowing the plants. This is what I really need, but the the chance of getting it is just so terrible. I mean, I guess we can try it. Thirty nine percent. If I go up to like everybody, it's still thirteen percent, thirty nine percent. So I'm gonna leave it at five, and I guess just just hope we get it. It's a day 20 hours that we're using five of our farmers working on this instead of bringing food in. So it's really rough, but I really need it. Maybe I can... Well, I don't know. I don't know if I, if I want to risk it. And I don't have any artisans, so no one's working on this. Um, and I have one official. Two officials now working on this one. So, um, we also have archery we, we want to get, and, uh, and and metallurgy as well. I really need this one. I'm going to go ahead and... What if I just put, like, four in there? Does it change that? It doesn't. It just goes slower. So, let's, let's do three. How about two? Okay. I will do two farmers. Four days, I will do three farmers. Four farmers acceptable. Okay. 
Two days, seven hours. Hopefully we can get, hopefully we get this because we really need doctors around here to deal with a sickness problem. Um, let's go back and look at the capital, cap, capital and see how it looks before we leave here. Um, are you at 50? No, you're going to be a little while before you hit 50. Uh, back over here in Ruthenia. Two is really good. That's the best it's been. It was actually at 10 a minute ago, but that's the best it's been in a long time. We've had the vital needs met. We just haven't had, I guess, the health issues. So sicknesses are a problem. People are getting murdered also. Um, so yeah, we got a bunch of houses in here. Look, we got some things moving around. I'm going to put some roads in here to make this thing look a little more organized. Our main downtown's right in here. We got some houses along the coast also. Um, we have our paddock right in here, which is being worked by somebody. Uh, we also have a granary here that no one is working because we do have uh, 50 available jobs. Which is a little bit terrible. Um, I, I've i been wanting... i got tons of hoes here. I've been really wanting to upgrade these, but I, I don't need... I, I don't need to, actually. Um, I, I kind of do, but... Actually, you need to be working. Um, it's important that someone is in here working. Bring me in a little, a little bit of... Mm, get two of these guys in here. Bring in some meat, please. Um... And yeah, and and all these places are working at maximum capacity, bringing as much food as they possibly can. And we just don't have enough pigs to run it. So every time a pig comes in, they go back to the farms to get farms working. Um, but we just don't have enough pigs to, to do the jobs. I've closed everything else down. So uh, we're doing everything we can, but I really don't have anything else we can do. Um... I'm going to fire one each. Well, I put two because because you guys are working on that job. But I'm going to put you down to just one. Someone else can go work on uh, on farming. All these are turned off. I don't need those right now. It's not, not urgent. And um, you're bringing a little bit of meat there too. So so that's what's going on around here. Um, nothing else really I can do at the moment. I, I am still happy that I built the second town. I think that was... I think it was wise... Even though we were hurting with people. Um, well, I think what we'll do once we do get this one at 50. And we can move him. We'll move back. We'll, we'll pick up some hose. We'll drop some meat, some meat off. Pick up some hose. And because there's a ton of them here. And run over to Mount Untinti and get planting going. There's not a ton of people around here. But there's and we have available jobs. But we'll get at least some more food going on. And we're going to go explore. We're going to run through here. Maybe we'll go north is difficult because of the mountains. But we'll, we're gonna fight. We gotta go somewhere and hopefully get some of those, um, those those pop-ups for uh, finding things, finding pigs just running around the countryside, um, if we can. So that's uh, that's that's what's going on right now. We will uh, pass some more time here and uh, see uh, see how things play out. Protected by our prosperity? Question mark. Uh, a primitive tribe of hungry nomads has arrived in Ruthenia and want to live here. They are welcome to live here. That's for sure. Found some stones. Excellent. Uh, so we've met a few folks. Um, I've met a few folks uh, that I, I know. Um, we've got down here, we have Viking Kim, who uh, does not live here anymore, but lives over in Hoggy City now. Is that you? Yeah, there's there's uh, Viking Kim. So we know Viking Kim, um, who's actually been talking to us. Uh, I welcome Viking Kim's prosperity. All right. These Vikings have been signed. Uh, human uh, hunters have have catched some wild chicken in Ruthenia. Got lucky, managed to capture some chickens alive, and have put them in cages to keep them in case we need fresh meat. Really? Well, that's that's really good. That's really good. Uh, asylum seekers, hunters, more chickens? Really? So I have managed to get um, animal cages that uh, Drake Hawkins gave us, and. That means we have llamas now living in our place. There's no chickens here, though. Um, so we, we have a paddock, and we have llamas living in the paddock. So uh, that's that's very good. We, we'll get butchers coming in, so we get some more meat flowing in here. Uh, we'll see how things are looking here in the territory menu. If it opens up. Here we go. Uh, Ruthenia is actually losing people now. Um, we're up to 216 pigs. We've gained, what, like 100 in, in, in just a couple days. So that's really good. We need a little bit more food. I think what's what's kind of saving us here is we had our army just running around and and scooping up llama meat and taking it back home. 
This one's not looking so good. Only eight farmers here in this place. So what we may have to do is go kill some, some cows and haul them back. Um, I don't think I, I recorded this either. I had some issues, but I had some wolves attack Mount Untinti, which is why we're missing some people here. However, however, um, we should have a wolf in our... Um, no, you're not. Where is he? We know we have... There he is! We have a wolf warrior as a defense, because wolves came and attacked us. We got a pop-up for wolves attacking us. And one of them decided... I mean, they came in, they murdered all of us, all my defenders, and we basically were out of people. Uh, so my, my army turned into the Mount Untinti orc force. And one of the wolves ran up here. One of the wolves graciously decided to stay behind and become um, a, a wolf rider, I guess. Um, anyway, let's uh, let's jump in here and see what this chicken thing's all about. So you say uh, chickens came in. Does that mean there's like a new spawn of chickens on the map? Or, or they would go into... I mean, they didn't go into here. So I don't know what that means. We do have a paddock. We don't have an open paddock with someone working yet, however. So, um... I don't know what that means. Let me let me see here. If we go into the hunting... Do we have a new one? No. Hmm. I'm not really sure what that means, but okay. Whatever. Um, there's all the chickens that are here. I mean, we're already hunting these chickens. So, I'm not... I'm not entirely sure what that means, but okay. Um, I want to, before we go and set this battle up, uh, I would like to abandon these. I'm going to des destroy all these so our stuff will go inside. So when we do get attacked, we'll be defending behind the walls. Make sure my army is set up. Then we'll do this uh, Asylum Seekers one. That's the one where some people come in looking for asylum, and then we have to fight off the barbarian pigs. And make sure my, my military is set up properly. What do we have here? 24 cheesemongers. Oh, yeah, well, we're pretty good. We're pretty good, actually. Um, you guys are all defending... Restricted engagement. No, no, no. I want you to go into defensive zone one. Okay. You. Defensive zone. Sure. And you can be up here defending defensive zone two. What? Stop moving around! What am I... What, what, what am I doing wrong here? <laughs> what, what? Stop moving around! Um... Whatever. Whatever. Done. Okay, so let's call on this. Nomads have arrived. We've got eight families coming in. Ten of them will, will, uh, will have to fight off. Um, we'll receive some loot. We have some extra pigs. Let me just grow this up a little bit. Let's put in some more um, warriors, I guess. And, oh, no, we don't, have any, we don't have any wood here. That's a problem. Reinforce more stick, uh, some rock throwers. Let me go to ten of those. So that'll give us a decent amount. Can I give you? I don't have more javelins here. I don't think. Oh, I have hundred and five javelins. <laughs> I have a few javelins. Not enough pigs though. Okay, that should work. Nobody die. Okay, we don't have enough people here to risk death. Understood. Growth is okay. Uh, hunters, and I think I have finally figured out it's it's the health problem. Sickness is is killing us here. I don't think I can figure it. 30 sickness is really bad. We got that tech coming in. We did get uh, the leadership one. Which I think gives me the ability to create... Um, wait a minute. Does that give me... Does that give me new policies? It does give me new policies. I think I want this to be like 99, right? I want all my wealth going in here. It doesn't really matter right now, actually. So, no. So, no. We'll leave this at 5. Whatever. Um, gives us a leader, gives us... Yeah, we want this, definitely. Add that thing. We're gonna lose ban, so ban society, which is fine. Okay, we now have... We now have state power. That's very good. That's very... That's very good. Legitimacy... Do I have anything... I... I do? Common good gives us importance of the Senate or the Ministry, which we don't have. Or power protector of the people gives us military strength. How much military strength affix legitimacy? Um, sure. Add that one in there. Can I do both of them? I think this one... Can I add this one also? Yes. Okay, so we're to 11 now because of our military strength. We still have the state power. Economy's looking good. Can I do anything else here? No, we just still have the gift economy. Social, we have food rationing, which we, we don't need. Um, we didn't need it earlier, but we didn't, we're not going to do it right now because we keep our people happy. 
Um, okay. This isn't a big deal yet until we need money. Um, okay, let's talk with this one. Oh, there, oh, there it is. There it is. Okay, so we'll get attacked by these guys. We're going to bring in eight more people, though, into our town. Which is going to give me a... Uh, well, there they are right there. And... As long as they all survive... This will be very good. Where are those pigs? I hear you, pigs. Who knows? Here they come. That's all we have, just these ten? Okay. We should be able to murder them outside the gate. And I, I think we finally turned things around. This 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 episode went from dark times to uh, potentially happy times. We we started. We have like 330 people in our, in this town. Uh, last episode, a week or so ago, and now we're, we're back up to 258. We're down to almost 100, and most of those being sows and, and children. And then we oh you morons! No, turn around! I told you to play defense. Don't go charging in there like a bunch of idiots. Oh boy. Well. Can't tell them now. So they're all gonna die. Yeah. Oh boy. Maybe I build a, a third defensive zone and and they make them. Oh, they killed every single one. I killed one. Oh boy. Well, so we gained eight. We lost five. So there's a net of three. <laughs> we'll see how this goes. Um, they should come and try to come in here. We don't have any more stockpiles outside, so they'll come to here and, and fight us. Um, I'm really happy we got more pigs in here than now, though, because we had so much, such a shortage of people, of pigs, that we couldn't get any of our farms and things working. But we're going to take some of these guys and send them over to Mount Antinti. Don't burn my trees down. That's not cool. What do you mean defeat? They didn't take anything. They just came in and killed some pigs. I want to kill them, though. No, fine, whatever. Doesn't do anything to me, though, right? That's strange. I wonder... They're, they're fighting it out. They're going to run away here in a minute. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to make up an army here and send them over here. Um, these guys need... Let me check on these guys. They need, so how do we do? So yeah, we... They killed five of us. They lost one. They did take a few things. I don't know where they got them at. They're laying around somewhere, I guess. All right. Well, whatever. That did not work out really like it ever does. Um, so we have someone working the well. We have... How many, uh, how many workers do we have here? We have eight. They're all working on the farms. Um, which means we're not making... Oh, we do have hoes here, though, because we brought them... I brought them over earlier. So, um, I'm going to just keep on cranking you out. This is beans, so let's put in... We got one thing of beans. Let's put it in. Uh, two things of beans, apparently. Um, there. That's a little off, but it's two. Um, this one's going to be... There's only one guy working here, so let's go look at this one. This one's got two at 100%. Eight. Three, four, five, six, seven. Where's the other guy at? I need one in the well. Um, it says it's a farmer. I don't know where he's at. Okay. Um, let's put a little more rice in here then. Crank it right in... Uh, right in here if we can. Back this way. Okay, so how you doing now? 100%. There we go. Actually, we have a little too much. But we'll get another farmer in here eventually, and then that'll be fine. And um, we'll be in better shape. This place certainly needs some meat. We could certainly use a butcher here, which we can make uh, to help with the, uh, the paddock. But again, there's no people here, so we're going to go get that right now. Let's go people this place. There's those barbarians over there. So, over here in Ruthenia, I need a new formation here. The Peacemaker is going to be named. Fine. Um, I want you to have... We don't need any more sows in this army, but we do want... Um, regular old porcos. You can have, like, five of them. I can't really do away with a bunch, but five is... I think plenty. So, it's five porcos. And you can have... Take as many girl pigs as you want. Not a bunch. Just take a few of those. And then we'll bring in... Um, we have hose. What do we need to bring to this? I'll bring one carrier. 
can't really build an army. We, we've got this one guy here who's from Ruthenia. I guess I shouldn't. Yeah, change your name over here to Mountain Tinti. And I'm tempted to just let you just stay here. We could build an army real quick. Go kill some llamas and then bring them back. There's only one llama, There's only one llama here? Okay, let's do it. So I want you to recruit a troop. What do you mean? I just changed you. Um, aren't you changing? Um, well, he apparently doesn't want to work. Um, okay, we'll run back over here real quick. Avoid the barbarians. Come over here. Grab a couple people. Go get that llama. Bring it back. Drop it off in Mount Atiti so they have Mount Atiti so they have meat again to get their vital needs back up because they are short on food. Man, this is this is quite the struggle, but but maybe we'll get it turned around. I really need to do some exploring as well. Um, actually, it might be better if I just expand this one and put these guys into that new army. Can I tell you to transfer into... Is it the Immortals? Is that your name? Yeah. Into there. Okay. We still have the supplies I pulled? No, you don't. Um, okay, so bring in these five. And the six girls. And I want you to bring in a, something of military. Uh, something that can kill that thing over there. We can get a wolf warrior if we can hire a mountain team. We don't have people here, though. Uh, let's grab... I think Rockthrower is going to handle a llama. I wish I had something better than warriors. I don't even wood. I got one wood. Okay, one warrior. And we're using, we're using a lot of pigs for this. And two javelin ears. I'm going to lower you down. Okay, so... I didn't abandon too many people, right? Only 4%. We have hunters, farmers, sailors, officials. Okay, so... Not terrible. Growth rate is still going down because of a lack of health. And that is all dependent on... This one. Knowing the plants. 40% chance of getting this. We got 19 hours left. Maybe we can do this. Okay, 34. Is that enough to kill a llama? It better be. Three. Okay. Come here. Uh, go over here and go kill the llama. Let's go here first. Drop off. Then go kill the llama. With a few more people, we'll be working in Mount Ontinti. We'll have them go do some work. And uh, then we'll be set. So that's the plan. Um, we probably won't be able to do it this time, but I'll do it here in a couple hours whenever they get their units back. But uh, we'll drop some folks off, get some farming, go kill that, bring some meat back so they have a little bit of food so they can grow some more. And that's it. Thanks again for watching. And I think this is going to be it for this episode. Next time I'll try to keep things a little bit more understandable. I apologize for all the bouncing around that we had to do this time. But uh, you pigs get to work. Um, you can stay there. So we got three of you. I'm going to come kill this thing. We could capture it. Well, we got plenty of them captured here. We'll get a, um, I bet we could probably go ahead and get a, uh, we'll do that next time. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.